coach tough night tonight, but a lot of fight in the Red Hawks just kind of recap the game or the match against Evansville. Yeah, I mean, we played our best game in the first set. Um, it seemed like after that, we just didn't have the same stamina. Um, so we need to look at that as a team. Um, and sometimes when you're fatigued you, mentally, it, you get a little worn down as well. But then I, they resurged again, and I really like how we fought back in a deficit that was so large that no one thought we would. And so we have a lot of fight and a lot of good athletes. We're just trying to become that team that's more in sync and saying things at the right time and making those decisions that only they can make at the right time. You talk about that first set. That was tremendous energy your team came out with. Just talk a little bit about that first set and, and that, that tempo that you had. Yeah, yeah, it was what we what we practiced for. Um, but you can never quite do it in practice like you want to see it in the game. And that was the best set we probably had uh, so far of our three weekends playing. Um, Sophie and Gabby kept us in the game. We were doing a lot of hitting line. Setters were obviously doing a good job with that. We started finding the tip holes, um, served well, uh, and we were passing fairly well. Um, so it was just something that we knew we could do, but we're just not doing it frequently enough where everyone's got that game together. So just need a little more time together. I, I'm very uplifted by what I saw tonight, just that we need to have a lot more stamina and belief in ourselves. You talk about that stamina and belief in yourself. This team did not quit tonight and, and really made that fourth set um, a, a real tough one for, for Evansville. Um, just what, talk a little bit about your team and, and their motivation right now. Well, I'll tell you, I really like this team because they bring it to practice and they come with a sense of purpose. And if, if anything, we need to last longer with things. But they, they love the game and the way in this day and age, some of these young women could be playing since they were 10. But we like to bring in the athletes that still love the game. And this is a great example of that. So with that, you can keep getting better. And as a freshman and sophomores in the lineup, get better and find that experience. I think we can be a team to contend with in the MAC. But, you know, we need a little more time. I like to slow time down a little bit and a few more matches. Um, 24 hours till your next match when you take on Northern Kentucky. Um, just talk about regrouping before tomorrow night's match. Right. They can't eat and drink enough fluids tonight and get a great night's sleep. And uh, we, of course, scouted them very well. And we know, I think, what we need to do, and they know what we need to do to win. And uh, we practiced it. So hopefully it's just a matter of waking up, sun's up, new day, and know that they can come and really cause havoc with another team and this time pull it out. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.